Okay, so I've had this car for 18 years. My concerns with it are the tires, the brakes, the carburetor. It's leaking something underneath. Mm. I have no idea what I'm doing. <laughs> Today is going to be uh, basically ripping out all the stuff that we're going to replace on this car. In part two of Kelly Osborne's 57 Chevy Bel Air POL feature, we'll walk you through this massive hot rod transformation with parts from performanceonline.com. Kelly's Classic received performance upgrades in every direction. Kelly will be stopping in style with POL's Blackout Brake Kit. Blacked out 13-inch disc brakes in front and back, backed in black by a POL booster and Willwood Master Cylinder. This easy-to-install kit will convert your old drum system into a stylish stopping stealth sled and won't cost a lot of bread. Move into suspension, POL's Stage 3 tubular control arms with all the American coilovers for a smoother ride, better steering geometry, and a two inch drop. The shocks are easily adjustable for a personalized, comfortable ride. We brought the back down two inches as well with POL lowering blocks with adjustable Alden American shocks in the back as well. Lower center of gravity, better handling, and an epic aesthetic. The power steering is not power steering, it's just really heavy. POL's power steering gearbox will require a lot less effort and an improved steering radius. Yeah, perfect. Yeah, we can match this, no problem. We've also installed a smaller diameter steering wheel and tilt shift column with perfect matching paint. Nice work as always, Johnny. Combined with new tie rods, sway bars in the front and back, we're looking at all new brakes, steering, and suspension parts from front to back. How cool. Oh yeah, cooling. Champion Cooling Systems stop by with their high-performance aluminum cooling system that works great and gives the engine bay a smile worth showing off. This mounts to your factory core support. You've got the advantage of having a larger radiator, aluminum so it dissipates the heat. You got two large fans that move a lot of air, two rows of one inch tubes, just a better all around unit. It looks great in the car. Mama needs some new shoes. And although we love the OG look she rolled in with, we cannot deny how kick ass this hot rod looks with its new stance sitting on some 17 inch American racing polished torque thrust wheels. We've added some blacked out headers from performanceonline.com, and now we're headed to see Albert at Speedway Mufflers to replace Kelly's rotting exhaust. So she doesn't want it too loud, but she wants a nice sound when she gets on it, so it purrs, and it can have a bark to it when you're done with it, you know? Yeah. Well, we're going with a complete uh, exhaust system from the headers back, all the way out the back to the back bumper with some angle cut chrome tips. In the next and final installment of this POL feature, Kelly comes back to POL to pick up the Bel Air and check it out for the first time. And then it's all aboard the Osborne Express to take it to the streets as we tag along for a joy ride and put these upgrades to the test. Thank you for shopping with P-O-L at performanceonline.com. Subscribe to our channel for more how-tos, featured customer rides, event coverage, and more. That's P-O-L at performanceonline.com.